Welcome to a very exciting update video here on Deconstructing the Home Show. I am out front of one of the largest projects we have ever done at 702 Mason Street in beautiful Government Hill, literally blocks from the historic Pool Brewery and the amazing renovation that happened there just a couple years ago. We are about two and a half to three weeks away from having this puppy completed. Um, if you remember, it was in really bad shape when we got it. The foundation took almost two weeks to get level. The electrical and plumbing systems had to be totally ripped out. And this was a deal that was taken over from another investor because the rehab got way off track. It's now back on track and headed toward completion. Um, you can see the house has been painted. We sanded all the old stuff down. The windows have been repaired and it's been sheetrocked and I can't wait to uh, take you out toward the inside. So come on inside. I'm hoping Juan doesn't cut my fingers off. That wouldn't be a good one. But here we are. So this house has now been fully sheetrocked. We have all the major uh, systems obviously roughed in. It's been textured. And while we're going to start painting, primed today and painting tomorrow? All right, fantastic. So again, for quick recap of the layout, we have our whole kitchen designed over here in this corner. We're going to have track lights all over the across the front. We have our two lights. Our windows providing some extra daylight coming in from the side over there. We built an entire pantry over on this side. We're gonna have a second sink with a wet bar, the fridge, and then you're gonna turn and you're gonna have this awesome open living area, dining area where everyone can hang out with these massively high ceilings that are just pretty incredible. Let's go back to the master. We've got a great little half bath tucked in here under the stairs again stupidly high ceilings that we're going to be doing covering with some shiplap and a bunch of other cool stuff which is going to be fantastic and then the whole master suite is here in the back of the house and here is your main master bedroom tons of light crazy high ceilings plenty of room for a nice king bed anywhere you want it take you into the closet ladies this is the closet you want to have boom baby Picture shelves and shoes all the way to the top. Crazy, crazy cool closet. I want this closet. My closet's not nearly big enough for my house. Maybe I'll just move in over here. We have a great master bath here. And we went all out with this bathroom. So what we've done, we have a separate, obviously, room for the toilet, but then we took wood tile and paneled the entire surround of this shower. You can come and see we got this beautifully thick wood tile that's gonna look incredible. We got a really neat gray cement floor going on, white bamboo vanities coming in, soaking tub, shower with rainfall ahead. It's it's pretty much everything you could ever want in a master bath. And of course you still got your windows. Pretty sweet. Come on upstairs. So you got the one living area downstairs, but here on the upstairs you got a whole other living space. And this house is really designed for fun, for entertainment, for having people over and enjoying that. You have another whole room up here. Mount a TV, giant sectional here, massive bank of windows. This house has so much natural light in it. It's really special. We're gonna put new flooring into the entire upstairs. You've got a third, your little third bedroom up here, tucked away. Great corners though, still light, still got windows, great closet, really special. On this side, we built an entire second master suite for this house. We took this entire second corner of the house and boom, another gorgeous giant room, tons of space, windows all around it, beautiful views of downtown, oversized closet here, and another cool, cool bathroom. What we did in this bathroom, you're gonna love. We did the whiteout effect, where basically we took subway tile, did it for the entire floors, and then we took white penny tile and did it for all the walls here in the shower. This is gonna be a freaking super cool master, second master bath, white vanity with bamboo. It's gonna be sick. 
finally, you have our third bathroom that we did a similar thing for, but there's black penny tile under here. And uh, let's see if we can get it without ruining everything. Where are you, black penny tile? It's gonna be cleaned, a really cool, modern, black and white look to these bathrooms. So, this house is really coming along. We're super close to being finished. We're getting the team ready, and all the fun finishing touches are about to go on. Oh, I forgot, we still have another room. We built a study. You have an upstairs study in here. Sconce lines, more ship lap in here, great windows, awesome place to come out, hang out, get some work done, plan the future, plan world domination, because those are the kind of living spaces we create here on Deconstructing the Home Show.